subscribe to my channel and press bell icon for latest updates. Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Raghuveer. In this class, we will discuss about sigmoid function. We use this sigmoid function not only in logistic regression, we use this extensively in neural networks. In this class, we will discuss about what sigmoid function and what's the uses of sigmoid function. So let's analyze the sigmoid function. Then we will understand what's the uses of sigmoid function. The sigmoid function is given like this. Sigma of x, this is the symbol for sigmoid function. Sigma of x is equal to 1 by, this is the equation of sigmoid function, 1 by 1 plus e power minus x. We know the e value is equal to, e is equal to 2.71. So now let's understand how sigmoid function behaves at different values so that that will get a good idea about what sigmoid function is doing. So at x is equal to 0, substitute x in the equation at x is equal to 0, 1 by 1 plus e power minus x minus x can be written as 1 by e power x, 1 by 1 plus 1 by e power x plus we, we, we place it as 0, 1 by e power 0, e power 0 means 1, 1 by 1 means 1, so 1 plus 1 is equal to 2, 1 by 2 is equal to 0 0.5, at x is equal to 0, so we are having a value of 0 0.5. Now let's x is equal to 1, 1 by 1 plus 1 by e power 1, uh, that is equal to 0 0.7, so we are having somewhere here like a, it's 0 0.7. The same way at x is equal to 10, we are having a value of 0 0.9999950 something. So at x is equal to 10, we are having a value, the sigmoid function is having a value almost near to 1. So at x is equal to plus infinity, 1 by 1 plus e power infinity means infinity. So 1 by infinity is 0. So 1 plus 0 is 1, 1 by 1 is equal to 1. So at x is equal to infinity, we are having a value of 1. So what's the maximum value we got in sigmoid function? We are having a value of 1. The same way we analyze the how it's behaving towards the negative side. We analyzed in positive side. Let's analyze in the negative side. At x is equal to minus 1, 1 by 1 plus e power minus of minus 1 means plus 1 e power 1 means 2.71 power 1 means 2.71 1 by 1 plus 2.71 that is equal to 0 0.26 at x is equal to minus so it's reducing down here so at x is equal to minus 1 at x is equal to minus infinity 1 by 1 plus e power infinity means minus of minus infinity means plus infinity e power infinity means infinity 1 by 1 plus infinity means infinity 1 by infinity is equal to 0 so at x is equal to minus infinity we got a value of 0 so what's the minimum value we got in sigmoid function 0 what's the maximum value we got in sigmoid function 1 so this is how our sigmoid function looks like it looks like the shape of s okay so what's, what's this sigmoid function is doing? As x value increasing, it went up to infinity. When, when it went up to infinity, what's how sigmoid function has done? It squashed, it squeezed, squashed or squeezed, it's reduced the value to 1. The same way when the x value went up to minus infinity, when it went up to minus infinity, what's how sigmoid function has done? It squashed, squashed the value to 0 means this is a squashing function squashing means squeezing reducing the value it's a squashing function uh, there are so many squashing functions sigmoid function is one of the squashing squashing function squashing means reducing the values to the values between 0 and 1 here how it is squashing it is squashing the values to the values between 0 and 1 that's the use of sigmoid function we use this function in logistic regression so in our next classes when we discuss logistic regression we use this there you have to get an idea when we are using squash sigmoid function you have to get an idea what's the use of this sigmoid function the sigmoid function will squash the values to the values between 0 and 1 that's the use of sigmoid function okay hope you understand the concept if you have any questions regarding the concept please post your questions in the comment section below thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates. Thank you.